Don't place a trade based on what you'll see in this video because there is no guarantees of making a profit in the market. It takes you a long time to become a good trader. So this video here is just to educate you to become a much better trader. Alrighty traders, so we are gonna have a look at the stock market. We are going to look at the Dow Jones, S&P 500 and the NASDAQ. <laughs> I think that's the, um, the other one there. Let's have a look at the Dow Jones first. The first thing I wanna share with you on the Dow Jones is are we starting to change the trend? Is the market giving us a bit of a warning sign already that the market is starting to change trend? The reason why is because if you look at the market, right, the, if you look at the moving average, if the market's making higher lows above the moving average, then that's pretty strong, right? If it starts to make lower highs below it, pretty weak, then we start to make higher lows, lower highs, and so on and so forth, right? So you can see how when we get, that could be a sign. So what I'm saying here is looking at the Dow Jones, look at this Dow Jones here. Really, really, geez, <laughs> what happened in my voice <laughs> just then? <laughs> but look at this here, low, this higher low, this is actually a slight lower low from this low here. Because if I actually put a line through there, look at that, it actually made a slight lower low. Mm. Interesting, interesting. So if I zoom right in on the last couple of months, we can see we've actually came down, made a slight lower low. In fact, we actually made a double bottom to slow here, but we actually made a slight lower low. Is this now a sign that we're getting ready to roll over? Interesting, right? Because we're below the moving average, definitely on the Dow Jones, we're below the moving average, and that could be a sign. What do we need to see that this thing is now likely to roll over and potentially head to, and be heading right back down towards these lows back here? We need what? Say it with me. We need a lower high. So, be really interesting to see what's going to happen moving into tomorrow and moving into next week about what's going to happen with these markets here. Are we going to hold here and then start the break back down? And if we do, low, lower low, lower high, breaking past previous lows, guess what? If we're likely to see some strong selling, some strong selling, this is probably what we're going to see in the market here. Really, really, really interesting. And I always say that the Dow Jones is the leader because <laughs> really, right? It's like the top 30 stocks in America. I believe that's the leader of the other indices. The other indices may, if you look at right now, right? The other indices, the NASDAQ and the S&P, what do they do? They started the run on, didn't they? Where the Dow Jones didn't. The Dow Jones was saying, hang on a minute, you, you may be running on, but no, nah, something's not quite right. And then we, then they, then they all pulled back. So that's really interesting to see what's happening through it. Now, if I go to the S&P 500, uh, it's not below the moving average and it didn't make a lower low. So again, the Dow Jones is, is starting to shift, right? It's starting to shift more of a weakness on the downside. Let me share with you what I mean here. If I go back to the time, look at this here, right? Um, we go back back here to October, November. Look at this here, high, lower high. This is pretty much an equal high through here, okay? Now, if I go to the, um, if I go to the Dow Jones, look at this here, and I wanna share this with you here because the Dow Jones has always given us a bit of a key here, okay? Um, well, it's pretty much the same here, but you can see here, right? We had this high and then a lower high and then breaking of these lows through here, same for same for the NASDAQ and the S&P 500, okay? So the whole purpose here, you guys, is that if we start to roll over here, that could be a sign that we're starting to, because as you can see, right, we're definitely starting to shift out of this upward movement, right? And we're below these major levels through here. So be very careful, guys. Oh, be very careful. What the hell, what the hell, what the hell does that mean? Well, be very careful. Um, guys, if you are very bullish right now and we start to roll over through here and we start to create what? That lower high, breaking past previous lows? Then yeah, we could start to see some strong selling in the market again, back down towards these lows. Same for the NASDAQ. That's right, the NASDAQ. That's what you need to call it, the NASDAQ. <laughs> so look, same thing for here, right? Look at this here. Look where it stopped today. Interesting, right? Like the last sort of since the start of the year, NASDAQ, right? Broke down. That was the low here, right? Notice how it's pretty much an equal low to here. Now, in a strong market, in a strong market, what do we have? We have higher low breaking past previous lows. This here is roughly a 50 to a 60% retracement and then it continues. 
But if the market rallies up and then rallies almost back down to the previous low, call that low, that low there, see how that's now showing a lot of weakness in momentum, right? Strong momentum is up 50% retracement or 60% retracement, continue, break it past previous highs. Break it past previous highs. Look at this here. Low, 50% retracement or 60% retracement and continue up. Come back down. Oh, equal. So see how we're now, the market's telling us, right? The market's giving us a bit of a, hang on, momentum's really starting to shift here. It doesn't mean it's definitely going to go down. But if we start to get a lower high here, do, 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 and we start to hit, and then once we break that level, it'll be a lower high, which also could be shoulder head shoulder, right? Lower high, breaking past previous lows. Then, then if we get that, that's when we're likely to start to see the big movement down, okay? So if you go back to say when that October, when did, when did we start to get the big, when, when did we start to see the, the strong selling in, um, in, in, in December? When, say it with me, when we had a, when we had a what? We had a high, a lower high, a low, breaking past previous lows through here. As you can see, this whole level through here was major support. Low, lower low, lower low, uh, low, uh, low, uh, low, uh. <laughs> can't talk today. Um, lower high, lower high. Look at this here, a slight little lower high, breaking past previous lows, and that's when we went through a nice run, didn't we? Because once it, once it started breaking past those levels there, same for right now. So be really interesting, guys, to see what's going to happen here right now, because we are definitely breaking below this level. And as you can see, it's rejecting at that level there. Uh, the Dow Jones is not, the Dow Jones is actually already a lot weaker on this level. So you can see the Dow Jones is a lot weaker, right? As you can see, it's already made a lower low. So the Dow Jones is giving us a bit of a lot more weakness and the same for the S&P 500, right? So uh, be alert for this lower high. If it starts to create this lower high and we break past these previous lows, guys, be ready for a lot more downside to come. Hey traders, thanks for watching my YouTube video. I've just released a brand new training. It's 100% free training. And you're gonna learn the my number one most powerful trading technique, a slash chart reading technique that I use that actually helps me get up to a 90% success rate. I use it, it's a very big part of my trading system. You're gonna absolutely love this. This is what I call going with the stream. So when you pick it, when you, when you find big, big strong currents in the markets, that's what this is all about. So very first thing in the description below, guys, go click on that and you can go register or you can go get access, instant access to this free training right now and start to apply this to your trading right now. So click on the very first thing in the description below and go get free access to this training and get instant access right now.